Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I have just a quick activity that I want to do with you. We're going to create two lists. One is going to be for your classroom and what you use for teacher tools. The other one is going to be a school-wide or central and in middle school school-wide list of tools that you're going to use. Now, to do that, it, let's make this real easy. You're going to go to Google. And you're going to open up the browser and you're going to type in bit.ly forward slash and the little bit.ly link that I'm going to give you. When you do that, it's going to open up this page right here. Now, it may look slightly different than the page that I have here, but our goal here is to put everything on this page that you use as a teacher, a tool in your classroom. So, for example, you may say, well, I use a textbook. Absolutely. Now, if you don't use a textbook, guess what? You can hit delete. All right, I, I don't use a textbook anymore, so I'm, I'm going to hit delete. Now, maybe you say, well, I certainly don't use an overhead projector. That guy's gone out of there. Uh, but you say, I definitely use Promethean board. In fact, I put a Promethean board on everyone's because I was told that everybody has Promethean board. Now, you see Kahoot. Here, here's some VR goggles. Those are great. What I want you to do is I want you to think, what else do you use? Now, for me, one of my favorite things... One of my favorite tools is Edpuzzle. So if I go to Edpuzzle and hit enter, it takes me to Google. And I want to go to images. And since we're not publishing this, we can use this without fear of copyright infringement. So once you go to typing in Google what you want, go to images, find the image, right click. It brings up copy image. You can copy that image, go over here, and you can right click again and hit paste. Now, there you go. I use Edpuzzle. Now, oh my. Well, see, that's a lot of white space. So, you know what thing I'm going to do real quick? I'm going to crop this guy down and make him a little bit smaller so he fits in a little better. And maybe I even shrink him down a little bit because I have lots of tools that I use and I think that's great. Okay, now that's a technology thing. Maybe you use a digital camera, maybe you use a, a digital microscope, maybe you use uh, all sorts of like a document camera. I'm using a snowball microphone right now. I'm talking to you on a webcam. I could put all those things on there, but let's go with something that's a tool that is not necessarily tech because we need to remember that tech does not equal education and tools could be both tech or non-tech. So one of the things that I think that every classroom can't do without these days is dry erase markers. All right, so dry erase markers, and in fact, you'll notice I haven't been able to spell since 1991 when Word uh, put the spell check available with the little red underline. So I hear here's some dry erase markers. I like those. I'm going to hit copy image, go over here, and I'm going to hit in my teacher tools. I'm going to paste them. Very good. Again, I could resize them. I could crop them, make them so that they're not offensive, by the way, for all you OCD people. There you go, just slightly off. Okay, so it gives a little flair. Now, that's your own page. I want you to put everything on there that you use. So put all that in there. Now, if you're a science teacher, maybe you say science equipment broadly, okay? I, I don't know. You get to choose. You get to choose. But the big thing is you're also going to have a second bitly, and that's to open this page. This is our teacher-wide or school-wide teacher tools list. And so I want your list, come over here, and I want you to take things off your list and put them over on the teacher list. So for example, I want to grab two of these, so I click and drag, selects two of them, control C, or I could right, right click and copy, and I could hit control V, paste, or I could right click and hit paste. So that's a pretty safe bet. I will probably go ahead and put this on there for everyone because I know you guys all have the Promethean board or smart board. And so then from there, your job is to take things that you use, maybe you're a Kahooter, and you hit paste, there you go. And so by the time we get done with this activity, I want an entire page of all the stuff that you guys use. Okay, let's get started. Start your own page, go to that bit.ly, get it all put together, and that way we can see it. All right, thank you very much.